if you want to communicate with individuals, you're going to need to know how to write and send an email. For example, an email address cannot contain any spaces. It's also important to insert a subject before sending your email. You also need to know how to insert text into the main body of your email. So to send a new email, you can simply go up to the top left hand corner and select new email. Once you select new email, an email message will appear where you can enter your information. So the first field here to enter is the to. So you're going to add a recipient to this email. You can simply type in the email address and make sure there aren't any spaces. You'll notice below when I was typing my email that a suggestion had come up from my contacts. You can select the contact directly from the suggestion and it will show up as well in your email to category. Just below the to and the CC, you'll notice there's a subject option here. I would recommend that you put a subject line because some people will not open their emails unless there's a subject pertaining to the email. So I'm going to select this line with my mouse and type in a subject. Once I've selected my subject, I can simply select tab and go to the body of my email. So I'm going to start off my email with hi Marcus and then I'm going to write the body of my email. And then once I've typed my email, to send it, I can simply go up next to the two and select the send option here. To verify that my email has been sent, I can go to the left hand column here and select sent items. Within the sent items, I can see that the email I've just sent here is at the top. If I open my colleague's email to verify that the email has arrived, then I can see in my colleague's inbox that he has indeed received my email. I'm going to exit this browser and I'm back to my inbox. So now you've seen how to send an email within Outlook 2016.